Hello everyone. Um, today I am coming with um, the cards for my <clears throat> the mid-month um, 15th collaboration with Paige and um, Peggy who are um, Pe JP Peggy 2 and Stamp Girl. This month it was all purpose I believe. I decided to make autumn cards and I am so excited about them. They tr I think they turned out so great. So I used a lot of dies. So let me show you the first one here. Okay, I'll take it out so it... So um, this one I, I used... Uh, so I had, a, I had got, uh, got some card cards in a, in a um, D-stash and um, so I thought this color was perfect so I used this and then I put a green um, mat and then all the the top papers that I used are from um, I think it's Gina K designs it's, I think she has designs Gina K anyways Gina K and um, I had bought them a couple years ago she has the most beautiful papers they're a little spendy, but they're so beautiful, and the feel of them are so different than other cardstock that I I've, I've buy. Um, here, I, I don't remember who makes this Give Thanks, but I cut it out in some shimmer paper, and then um, I had these uh, acorn um, dies in my stash, as well as this one here. And I did this one in kind of a it's a greenish color. Um, I guess it shows up there. And then you open it up, and this one says, Leaves are falling, autumn is calling. And that is a new stamp that I just got from um, uh, Ally Express. Okay, so the next one <clears throat> is using a new die from Ally Ex Ally Express as well as the Caterpillar die, which is new from Ally Express that I, I just recently got. And um, what I did was, and if anybody else has any hints on how to get them to cut, hey, I'm willing to listen. I had a really tough time with the um, dies from China cutting through anything but paper. Um, I can use any of my other dies that I have, except the ones from China, and get them to cut just like butter through uh, felt, uh, foam, uh, material. I couldn't get these to cut, and I put, I added more, um, I had my metal plate, I added more paper on there. I, I tried everything to make it, and I'm not going to ruin my machine, so um, it cut that well. And then I had to just kind of cut them out because um, it just wouldn't it wouldn't cut through. Um, so I don't know if anybody else had that problem, but um, I've had it with all of my dies that I've bought. Um, and then I had this um, little sentiment here that says "Autumn Love," and the inside of this one. This is a um, tonic die that I had bought in last fall and I had colored the leaves in and I had these still in my stash so I decided to use that. And this one says leaves are falling, autumn is calling. The next one is also using um, dyes that I have got from um, eBay or uh, AliExpress, either one. So I used this pumpkin and um, this adorable scarecrow. Love this scarecrow. I like scarecrows. I think they're kind of cool. And I just put a little bit of, um, oh, what is this paper? Um, yeah, anyway, burlap. A little piece of burlap down here. Um, and I, I had these uh, stickers, these um, uh, chipmunks or squirrels and acorns in my stash. And then here's another one that um, I did on the inside. So I created five. 
This one I really like as well. This one is a little different. This, of course, is my um, Ally Express as well as this one. Here's another acorn, and I want to say the acorn is possibly a tonic dye as well. Um, and I don't remember who made these two dyes. Um, this one is has a, oh, actually I do. These are tonic dyes. This is a tonic dye. Both of these are, all three of these are tonic dyes. <clears throat> but they're, they all come from different sets. Last year I bought um, four sets that were, I got them together in a bundle and they were all um, fall related type dyes. And so um, that's where these all came from. And then the inside again is another one of those. And then last but not least, oh, and the, the if the words, um, like this autumn, this, this here, I had cut that out using my Cricut. I just had, I, when I cut them out, I had a whole bunch of them left over from last year. So I just used those as well as this one here that says happy autumn. And I, here's the scarecrow again. And um, I just put a, a felt kind of fuzzy leaf there and one up here and um, another uh, acorn branch done in um, the shimmer type paper with the same inside. So um, I'm real, I am really happy with how they turned out. I think that I managed to use um, several different company dies and, and create um, what I think is some pretty cute cards. So thanks everybody for watching and if you want to participate um, you're more than welcome to participate. Um, I'll leave a link to both um, Peggy and Paige's uh, channels so that you can go and check out their videos and um, I know there are others that are also entering but I don't I don't have the links to everyone so um, but thanks again for watching, and I hope you have a great day. Bye.